Hey everyone, welcome to the first person gameplay commentary. My name is Drybear and today we'll be playing Sobek in the left lane. Again, we needed a tank and I had a request for doing Sobek. I'm just going to start working through these requests. I have They're starting to <laughs> starting to pile up, I'm noticing. They're just coming from everywhere. Everyone wants me to play everything. So I'm going to start working through them as I see them and hopefully uh, I can get through all the requests that people want with the certain gods they want to see played. Um, Sobek is a magic damage tank. Tanks are very, very strong right now after the patch. Very, very strong. Something very difficult to deal with. Um, Sobek especially, his passive is called Blessing of the Nile. This gives him physical and magical protection. This will stack up. It also gives him physical power um, and gives him focus when he lands a basic attack on someone. You'll see they'll have a golden hat on. Um, this stacks up to three times. His first ability is called Charge Prey. This is a charge that if connect connected with a minion or a god will stun them for a brief second and then launch them behind Sobek. Really good initiation tool to just throw people around and just uh, get them out of position. All kinds of good things there. It's just a forward dash. This can also be used for movement. Um, if you would like to dash away, I can dash away here if I was in trouble. Second ability is called Tail Whip. This is a circular spin, which will do magic damage to everyone in a circle, um, knocking them outward from the epicenter of the circle to center. Um, this is a long animation, so you can't actually hit minions and gods that are outside of the circle because it'll continue to uh, do damage as you move. This guy's being a butt. Being a butt. Uh, generally, you want to be behind them when you tail whip them, so you tail whip them backwards. Always a good strategy. Third, third ability is called Sickening Strike. This is a cone ability, which will do magic damage to everyone in a cone. Um, for the damage dealt, it will also heal Sobek. Oh, this guy's crazy. Really rusty. I've been playing <laughs> Dishonored for the last few days. Uh, my internet was pretty poor, so... Um, getting these uh, s these smite videos back out. I'm gonna be a little rusty, um, and I'm still learning the new the new system. It's 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 wild. <laughs> I'm alone. There you go, buddy. Oh, the archers are on me. Stop shooting at me, buddy. Ultimate is called Lurking in the Waters, and what this does, it was, you'll dash down into the ground. Um, you still have a hitbox, so you can be pushed or blocked, um, but after a while, you will slow, while you're down there, you'll slow all enemy movement that are standing on the waters, there's a circular water around you. Um, you also regenerate mana while you are down there, um, and then after, I think, four seconds... Whoa, buddy. Calm down. After four seconds, you'll jump up doing magic damage to everyone around you. You can activate this early if you would like to uh, right-click it. This will do reduced damage, but also is really good for... Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Your middle tower is under attack. A little bit aggressive there, and I think he pulled he pulled minion aggro right as they initiated on him, so he was just getting slammed by minions for that whole duration. Um, made it pretty tough for him to survive that kind of damage onslaught. He really should be waiting for me to initiate here. But he didn't. He didn't. As far as skill belt goes, you almost always want to max out tail whip first. It does the most damage. I don't know why I have a point here. I think I was just zoning out. It's pretty late tonight. Back up here. Okay, that's not... Oh, the first ultimate of the game always lags you out. He's going to dash up. He's around an ultimate there. Uh, you saw the first Shibalanki ultimate of the game that froze my screen for a second. That's pretty common. Uh, they still haven't fixed that. So I'm going to wait for a bit. See if we can't get some, some heals out of that. First item I went for was the Mark of the Vanguard. It's a really good first item. Um, it's one of those items you're going to end up selling eventually. Um, so I, I don't always get it, but I got it this time. I'm just messing around with item builds and trying to learn the new system. The game has changed a lot, and there's a lot of different um, things going on. Uh, tanks are very, very strong right now. Um, there's certain uh, magic damage dealers that are very strong. Raw is one of them. Raw is very, very strong. I actually banned him this game. Did not want to deal with him. He's going to go for a dash here. If he can. If he can. Just being careful. So this is the range of the ultimate. You'll jump down and slow everyone around you. Regenerate mana while you're down. Um, the stats got increased. Um, they're all 300 now. All of them are 300. They used to, these used to be 100. Everything was lower. And these used to be uh, 400. Um, and the amounts that you get reduced. This used to be 10 MP5. This is now 5. Um, these all got reduced in mounts. This got increased. You know, everything got adjusted. This used to be 200 mana. This used to be, I think, 200 health. Lots of crazy stuff. Dr 
drop your guard and I'll snatch Be right you back. the banks like a naive gazelle. Yeah, the minion advantage right now is trying to back up. There's the hook on me. See, that does reduce damage. He's going to get off, but it's the best I can do. I tried to zone the damage dealer out, but wasn't enough. Missing those all day long. God. This new system is just throwing me way off. Somebody's going to pay for all those boots. Why are the enemies so bad going? Okay, I don't have time for you. I'm learning right now. Uh, reinforced boots. Sir, I am learning right now. Let me know when you're done. Let me know when you're finished. Maxing that out first. Always put points in your ultimate. Ultimate is one of those ones that's very, very good. You always want to put points in that when you can. Ult R, alt ready. I'm gonna head back. Recommended. <laughs> uh, let's see. Physical, magical, doesn't matter. Um, physical, magical. Good amount of magic. So I can go for the bulwark is always a good. I actually need boots pretty badly. There's some boots. deal with that. I can go for a second um, ability item, but I don't really need it. Looks like Freya's having a tough time mid. Uh, we're 0 and 3. Shabalanke is down 2. Freya down 1. Uh, we're only behind by 1.8k. Actually, 7 minutes in the game. That's pretty dirty. But we'll come back. We always come back. Right, guys? Yeah, that's right. That's right. Your middle tower is under attack. Actually, what I plan on doing is um, while I'm uploading this game, I'll probably play some Dishonored because I don't need ping for that. I don't need ping for that. Are we on a... Alright. That's right decent. Back. 130 ping. Getting that down. Your middle tower is under attack. Your middle tower is Come on, Shibalanke. Yo, we got a kill here, buddy. I don't know. Bro, minions aren't really that important. There you go. Get at him. I go around. This guy ain't getting away today. Keep chasing. You better keep chasing, Shibalanke. Now you decide to go crazy when there's a tower involved. Some of the mentality of people, I swear. I'm queuing with two subscribers today. Miris on Sun Wukong and Squigglesman on Ares. Just having some good times. Having some good times. You're welcome. Quiet. I mean... You're welcome. There you go. Enemies have returned to middle. Let this get me down a bit. And I'm gonna use my cone to heal myself back up. Your right tower is under attack. He's going for the rising jaguar. So that goes in, lands the charge prey. My ultimate's coming back up soon, which means so is the other guys is. Was a good response ultimate from our Shibalanke. Taking that down. Oh, he's going hard now. He decided he wanted to. Not a boy. 
You just... You make me so proud. You make me so proud. Pushing that down. Why are enemies incoming Enemy left? Missing Enemy missing right. Who's incoming left? Uh oh. Be careful left. An ally has Not all I can do. I was trying to stop him from ulting, but. Can't be done. We have a Freya coming in. I got three here. Freya might get turned on. It's just Shibalanke. Dodge the darts. If he's not going to follow, I'll just be. Does he get away with it? He gets away with it. Magic defense. I'm going to go for a Bulwark. Always a good choice. Good health. Health is very strong this early in the game. And then... Active beads, Aegis, Aegis. Probably just get an Aegis. Here we go. Off we go. Yeah. We're doing pretty. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I swear. Every game I'm in, it's tough. It's a tough game. Uh, I don't think Freya's that great mid. Especially up against, uh, I think he went up against Anubis. Okay. So Anubis seems to be pretty decent too. Let's just, um, you know, let him know we're here. There you go. This guy's all laggy pants. Bring these over. Bring these over. So looks pretty low. I don't know if I can catch him or not. Branching bolas. Enemies incoming left. Oh, again, huh? This guy's doing really good with the calls. I can definitely appreciate that. Shibalanke. What do we got going? We got a low Sobek. Oh, oh, oh. He took the long way. I guess he came in through a blue. Gonna fall for that. Hey, nice shot. Respect. He wants me to go behind him. Oh, there you go. What? No. Smart move. I'm gonna kill these minions. Anytime, Freya. <laughs> Anytime. Anytime you want to come join the party, you know you're welcome. I'll leave some chips out for you. That was a little bit aggressive for me. I thought Freya was gonna come with me, but I should I should know better. Big mistake on my part. I'm um, gonna miss the, the first charge. That really is what I needed to land. Ooh, the stun just in time. Wukong goes down. Bastet gets taken out. Aries getting pretty low here. Amir trying to push it, getting really close. Lands the stun. Does he land? He's got nothing left. His ultimate is down. All he has is his patch of ice. And that's about it. He's going to give up Chase. Nice hobo. Need mystical mark, huh? Not really. I mean, we have one physical and two physical. And he's not doing that great. Plus, he went for a Fatalis. Um, I, it'll help me with the damage, but... Your right tower is yeah. under attack. Well, doesn't really do a whole lot unless I'm just running around. I kind of wanted tanky first. But we can go. We can go with that. Rough situation. 
rough situation. This uh, Anubis is doing really well. Plus Doom Orb, about to finish Rata Tahuti. There's Anubis again. Probably get some ganks up on this Anubis after I get this. Some people do max out Sickening Strike first um, for the heal. I don't know if that still happens after the focus change. You better survive over there, Shibalanke. Nice try. Where did he shoot that from? No. No. He's gone. Unless he's tucked. Is he tucked in? Nope. Yeah, I see you. Alligator friend. Crocodile friend. Be right back. Be right back. Enemies have returned to that. Your left tower is under attack. Uh, not really a whole lot I can do here. Until that happens. Get some! Get him! Don't give up! Enemy missing no, why do you keep giving up? I have so many cooldowns to use for you! Oh, he's just gonna ulti. I don't know if I can prevent it. Sir? Friend? Friend? What are you? You have been slain. Ugh. Like you just not want to fight? That's one of my biggest pet peeves is when people are fighting minions and when there's a fight going on around them. It really bugs me. <laughs> Makes me really frustrated when that happens. Ended up picking off their Shibalanke, and I could have got that Anubis with a little bit of help. I mean, I was kind of like at, at my extended part there. That was a tough spot. Happy Amir comes out. Someone Kong trying to pop the ultimate. Going after the Amir. Amir drops really low on nothing because he's full HP. Bastet throws out the Razor Claws. Gets kind of a cold feet here. Ares comes in. Can still go after the Bastet. They have the minion advantage. They should be pushing this right here. Wukong goes in, tries to get on the Bastet, and you're taking some damage, but not a whole lot. Ares leading the charge as he landed chain. Neither Ares or Monkey has an ultimate up. Noob is pushing off the mid lane. Let's go gank this guy. Your middle tower is the dude who's attack. destroying my mid and coming to destroy me. Yes. He just ulted. I don't know if he saw me just now or not. He might have. That was right in his field of vision. Uh, Freya? 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 We're, we're ganking your lane, man. Freya? Yeah. Yep. Alright, alright. Freya! What? Well, she's here. She wants to participate. Nice. That was a good reaction. Freya! Play with me! Jesus! Oh, they're 
are so low too. Fra oh, there's a cat. Double kill, nice job. Um, let's go get some buffs. Get some buffs up. Buffs up. Soup, 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 soup. Probably get some wards up for my team as well. Get this farmed up here. An ally has been slain. People are getting killed in the right lane. Super unfortunate. Super unfortunate. Um, we're catching up a bit. We're bound by, behind by about 3k right now, which at this point in the game is not that bad. Should have got some wards. If I can't come over and help there. Shiblanki is on the right lane with an Amir. Anubis is in the mid lane. I'll get right lane. Group up. Ultimate pause at the second tablet. Keep moving. Shiblanki gets some good damage in there. Ares is going to go really low here. A lot of ultimates come out. We need to pull it back, man. Pull it back. Here's Anubis. Stop watching, dude! Come play! Are you... <laughs> you have been this hurts me, physically. Full HP, full mana. Full HP, full mana. I don't why <laughs> just fight <laughs> fight fight getting a slow lands a slow on the Sobek gets the banish off as well Shibalanki and Freya trying to take this to Sobek Sobek uses lurking the wires trying to get away cannot be slowed at this point they just need to be following instead of base attacking they can't give this up they can get this kill if they so choose charge break gets out Sobek getting the lead Freya farming Again, there he's fighting, dude. Dude, come on, he's fighting right there. All right, let's just. Ugh. He's trying to get really agitated. Sun Wukong leading up in the jungle, kind of head over to the left lane. Bastet coming in from the flank from behind. So back getting pretty low here. Freya again taking a lot of damage here, getting really low. Shibalanki also getting very low. A lot of damage coming out. Shibalanki's ultimate is still active. So is. Sun Wukong, Sun Wukong can still use his ultimate. Here comes the ultimate. Pause the second rune and keep going. They have the fire giant as well. I expect a mummify to come out from behind. That was the mummify. Now I can go ahead and charge this. Wukong needs to attack this. Ulti, just ulti, just ulti, right here. Just ulti. Wukong, you freaking ulti right now. Taking out the left tower there. We can go off this Amir. There's the sprint. They snuck a free fire giant from us too. Shivalanka gets taken out. Amir's still over here. Amir just came out. Get 
the Anubis. There's the player kill. See if I can't split this up a bit. The pull comes down, gets on the Shibalanke. There he's leading the charge here. Ultimate comes out, pauses the second rune. What's really going on here? Bastet. It's a bit of a trouble, pickled spot here. Freya coming out, doing some damage to the cats. Sun Wukong, Farman. Be right back. Be careful. I'm gonna go ahead and head back while I can. Get the slows and that kind of stuff reduced. Stay of the game, we're still behind by about 3k, a little bit. Actually, almost right on. Our 50 gold over. So still keeping that gap, which means they're not getting further ahead, and we're not getting further behind. What I want is the Bastet here. Throw her into my group. She's going to jump right away. There's the jump. Ultimate from the Sobek. I want to pull this off so I don't take that extra damage. Ultimate comes down. Gets the Bastet. Bastet... Dropping here, Sobek getting kind of low. There's the Happy New Year. I don't know if they're going to get either of these. Let's see if we can't come in here. Freya's attacking something. Throw this ward up. Pause the second rune, and then move again for some strange reason. Your left tower is under attack. He has a sprint up. Still have that ward there. Here comes the Ares ultimate. Pulls nobody. I'm going to get the slow in here on the Anubis. An enemy it's taken out. So that was a good team fight for us. Very good team fight from us uh, for us. Um, physical. Some health diverted to physical power. So reduce that. <laughs> Do we have any magic damage dealers? Not really. Guardian mail slow. Let's get this. Head on out. After that team fight, we're just closing the gap. We're at about 1k loss here, so we're kind of catching up. Doing really well here. All kinds of good things coming out. Let's see if I can't get this movement buff. And towards the later stages of the game, you want to sell your uh, Mark of the Vanguard and just replace it. It's an early game item. Take that out. They're fighting in the mid lane. Got that Bastet. Sobek's not with them. Sobek's in the left lane. Ares ultimate is ready. Let's see if I can't take their blue buff. Be careful, middle. Sobek comes in for the flank. I might have to come over there and just help him. There's the Sobek. Ultimate comes out from Shibalanke. They're going to initiate on this. If we can prevent the Anubis, there's the Anubis ultimate coming out. Dropping Shibalanke and the monkey right away. So back, I'm gonna meet up with my team here. Ugh. Where is Freya? <laughs> Freya, what are you doing? 
Oh, jeez. Aaron's getting kind of low here. Freya still not participating. Shibalanki had time to come back up. Aries leading it straight to Freya. Freya decides to fight by attacking walls. Sobek coming in for the flank here. Freya in a lot of trouble. Misses the banish. The Sobek ultimate comes out. Aries ultimate in response, but a lot of damage is going to come out. Aries gets really lower. They split up, which could be the downfall of either one of them. Freya is going to go down here. Pops the sprint, but Shibalanki gets the last hit. Ares makes his way out, meets up with Sun Wukong. Ultimate comes out from Shibalanke. Good pause there. Shibalanke come in from the gonna get the rising Jaguar. The slow comes out. Monkey goes for it. It's a very squishy character. You can probably take this out. Sun Wukong going after the Shibalanke. Shibalanke ult comes out, slows down, gets the stun off on Shibalanke. Bassett shows up, throws out the Nine Tails, throws out the Razor Claws. Happy New Year comes out. You need to get off that Anubis before he decides to drop some damage. Here comes the ultimate coming out from Anubis, drops down the Sun Wukong. Shibalanke get very low here, gets walled by a perfect wall, and the ultimate comes out for Bastet, and Shibalanke drops. And that's going to be it, guys. It was a very, very risky move going after those characters. Um, I think a quick pick on that Shibalanke could have happened. But I, I, a big focus on the Anubis. He has no defense. He's just a big squishy squish ball squish man. Coming out here. Um, they're probably doing Fire Giant to be honest with you. Um, since it did come back up. Um, it's most likely already done. I'm going to get some wards up here just in case. Throw one on the bottom. Movement going that way. Throw one here to see if they have any wards. Fire Giant is indeed down. Cover up their movement over here and probably take their mana buff if it's not up. Here's Anubis probably going for the mana buff to be honest with you. No, maybe not. Knows I'm here now. He's probably gonna throw down a grasping dead, grasping hands into here if he can. I want to get some alone time here. Shiblon come, ultimate comes out. Pause the second rune. Keep moving. If I can prevent Anubis from fighting, I think my team can take the rest of them. Anubis is the majority of their damage. If Anubis isn't there, they can't really take out enemy people unless they uh they screw up a bunch. Anubis is gonna be heading over here and actually goes for a buff first. Checks to see it. It's not there. He's gonna be running out right away, heading back over to farm. Anubis decides he doesn't want to play, which could be a benefit for us. I'm going to ward this up so close to the first one just because I want to know if Anubis joins. I want to make sure I want to prevent Anubis from joining here. Frey is about to get mummified from behind. And that's going to be that. Shimpalanke pushing in here. Mummify lands on him. This is not a good fight for us. We don't have our uh, anti participatory Freya. Ultimate comes out from the Anubis. I'm going to wait till it's ending. Get that down. I'm in a bit of a pickle here. I don't know why we're not. I don't. It's a tough loss there. I might just need to get some magic. Some magic damage. I, I, I didn't realize we didn't do that much damage. Um, we need a lot of damage. We're not really putting out enough damage to put them on, on, on tilt. Um, and we're kind of getting caught in most of the situations. So it makes it very challenging to deal with that. Um, they have a lot of tanks that are leading the way. And we're focusing a lot of our damage on the tanks. Uh, a lot of times Sobek and Amir are getting really low. And there's not a whole lot. He could have saved that ultimate there. There's no way he's going to defend that tower. That was a bit of a wasted ultimate. Um, a lot of times if you know the tower is going to go down, just save your cooldowns. There's no point in using them just because you're going to need them to defend the next part, uh, which would be the Phoenix. Uh, Ares is defending the right lane here. Uh, Phoenix attempt coming out from the mid lane. Mid lane actually goes down. The Phoenix attempt is successful. They still have the Fire Giant buff. Sobek goes for the charge, but throws the Ares back and the stun comes out from the Ares. Here comes the Ares ultimate. I might be pulling him in here. 
Freya's a little bit too short here. Here comes the Searing Flesh. Sun Wukong going here. Does no ultimate. Shibalanki uses Rising Jaguar. The chain does not land. Shibalanki ultimate comes out in response. Freya gets wrapped and gets taken down. A lot of damage come out. Ultimate coming out from Freya in response. Doing some good AoE damage, but is it enough? The Amir ultimate does not hit anybody. Our Shibalaki coming out here. Does he have an ultimate? He does not. Goes for the Rising Jaguar, but gets really low. Enemy Sobek ultimate coming out. Getting really slow on the Ares. Ares walks into grasping hands against Mama Fight and gets taken out by the Sobek ultimate. Freya and Shibalaki are last hope as Drybear comes back up. Trying to take this out. Anubis is our main focus here because he does all the damage for his team. Taking out Amir from the Phoenix here. I don't know why we're not fighting here. This is good eats. This is very good eats. They both have the opportunity to jump off. I need to focus on one of them. Okay. Guys, we can, we can kill people. I'm going to throw that right into Freya. There's the Freya. Turn around. Probably get this Bastet. I don't know if Shibalanki will turn around. Bastet heads over this way. This is good. Freya, you gotta fight at some point. You can't just let her run away like that. Looks like he's lagging. I feel kind of bad for this, but you know. Double Creeping Curse comes out. Getting some good ticks from Mystical Mark. The slow, the hit. Shibalanki might be backing around here, but not 100% likely. Come over here and take this out. Oh, there's a Sobek. What's up, friend? Sumukon coming out here, pushing the right lane. Fire Giant is back up. If we can get a wipe here, that'd be huge for us. Yeah, that's right, Sobek. I just backed right in front of you. Defend the fire giant. Defend the fire giant. Defend the fire giant. Group up. Freya's right to be here. We do need to push this lane up before it gets pushed into our Minotaur. Group up. Defend the fire giant. Group up. Defend the fire giant. Pause at the second one and keep moving. Happy New Year comes out from the Sun Wukong. Sobek ultimate does land. Gets Sun Wukong very, very low here. Don't do it. You stop that. You, you stop. You, Amir. Shibalanki getting really low here. Taken out. Getting stuck on top of the Amir ultimate. But is it a big deal? Not really. Throw him away. I get thrown with him. That was a good Aegis. Mummify's gonna come out probably right after. There's a the Mummify. Gets dodged there. Freya's still farming. <sighs> Why? I'm tanking everything for you. Why are we running away from this? There's a the Mummify. Really good Mummify coming out. That was a good response there. Might do a grasping hands. There's the... Get enough heal there. Is it gonna be enough? There's the cats. Freya's still farming the mid lane and I'm gonna... I'm actually starting to get really mad. He's defending the mid lane, but at some point you gotta fight back. We're losing team fights left and right. Your right Phoenix has been destroyed. So we're we'll trying to defend this right lane here. The minions come up. That Phoenix does go down. Bastet still sitting here. Pushing this up. Not a whole lot going on right now. I'm going to pick up some more wards for my team. Make sure those are covered in good fashion. Go for elixir of defense eventually. Or I can just get some more health. 
I have 32, 15, so probably some more protections would be good. Some of that might actually just go for some magic power. Do some damage, why not? I think if I went for a damage build this game instead of a tank, we probably would be in a little bit better shape. Um, we really did need a tank, but I didn't realize that we were not going to fight that much. Probably going to go for a split push strategy. For someone caught coming from the back end here, trying to jump in here. Does he have an ultimate? He does have an ulti. Shibalaki going after the enemy. Shibalaki, here comes the ultimate coming out. The Rising Jaguar goes out, but does he get stunned? What I want to do is make sure he doesn't get stunned in return. Freya coming out here. I'm going to throw him right into Freya. There's the ultimate. Stun comes out from Amir. There's the Freya ultimate. Yeah, I don't care about your ultimate, bro. Don't even care. He's going to go for I want to stick with him as tightly as I can, but it doesn't matter. Fling him into my team. Get the slow off. His Aegis is probably up, which means he's just going to Aegis this right away. Or not. Oh, he missed it. That's what happens when we fight back, folks. That's what happens when we fight back. Only you can prevent team fight wipes. Head over here, get a good buff. Nice job, you rock. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. I think I'm just gonna start putting stats into magic power at this point. Putting that down. Smacking this Cyclops. Come over here. Probably cover up the uh, Gold Fury. I think the Fire Giant is still down. We'll still continue to be down for about uh, three more minutes. Um, I'm going to come over here and get this CDR. Enemy is... There's only two of them. What are they going to do? There's two mid. And those are the two enemies. Left lane still has a tower. How long do we have? Shibalanke just came back up. Come over here and push this lane up. See if I can pull aggro from all of them. Bring them in a circle. There's all that. When he was coming up in six. Head back here. Get some more magic power. Just going to keep pouring points into it. Sun Wukong actually goes for the Gold Fury. Gets caught there by the Bastet. Bastet there. They're going to be grouping up pretty soon here. The Sobek shows up. It's just Ares and the Sun Wukong. Sun Wukong is still not level 20. Bastet and Shibalanke coming out here. Here's a Sobek. I'm going to throw out a ward right about there. See if we can't cover our flank. They're going after the Gold Fury. I don't know if it's worth it to come in here and try and steal this. Looks like they still got it. I'm going to stop his channeling there. We can fight this guy. I'm about to drop some fat deeps. An enemy, has been slain. enemy gets dropped. There's still no Amir. That was a 4v5. Anubis gets taken out there. That was our best pick. Pushing up the mid lane. If we can keep pushing this, we'll be in good shape. Get some more wards. Attack, fire giant. It's down. I'm pretty sure it's down. And then we'll have to push. Oh, it is up. Awesome. And we have no one down, so all of us will have that fire giant buff. It's still a possibility we'll be able to take this game. Yes. Yes, they are. Stay strong. Got that. There's three there. Dun, 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 dun. Movement speed is down. They took that out. We do have the fire giant buff.
Stuff's going down in the mid lane. Shiblonki ultimate comes out. Pause at the second rune and then keep on moving. Let's the fire giant buff. Do not waste that Shibalanke. Shibalanke get really focused here. Here's a rising jaguar, which he's just gonna use. This is a waste of ultimate by me. Getting really focused here. Anubis is coming from the right flank, I believe. Bastet gets really low here. Gets taken out by the Freya ultimate. I'm gonna throw him backwards, which is a bit of a an oversight, but there's a good ulti coming out. I want to get in front of him if I can. That was a good wall. Anubis is here. Come on, guys. Don't waste it. Don't waste it. Oh, the damage. There you go. There you go. Keep going. Don't give up. We're tanking it for you. Keep attacking. Keep attacking. Keep attacking. There you go. Get that tower down. Let's go for the Phoenix. There's only three of them up here. That was a good stun from the Emir. Attack the Phoenix, guys. Kind of tanking the Phoenix for him here. Comes the Shibalanki ultimate. There's the uh, stun from the Emir. There's that. Most likely going to be going for him. Me gives up on it, actually. Goes for the, the Freya. Does he have anything to defend this? He does. Getting kind of low here. Shibalanki going after me pretty tightly. Still have my Aegis, but is it necessary? It's taken out there. Sobek getting getting frisky. Be right back. Be careful. Be right back. Dun dun. Magic protection. Some more health. And some magic power. Be careful. We're actually behind by about 5k, um, but we're getting some good team fights here. Shibalanki's getting a little bit too overconfident here, still sitting in the base. They have two downs, so three up. Ymir's gonna be coming back up. Anubis is still there. Anubis does the most damage on their team. Bastet cats were used on me right before I left, so I know the ultimate is not there. Anubis Be ultimate's right. probably coming back up quite soon. Shibalanki's going for a blue buff. Eh. Retreat middle lane. I guess we're going for buffs. I guess it's buff day. Buff day. Everybody loves buff day because all you got to do is kill the buff minions. Anubis. Don't do it. Swear to God. Let's try. I see you because I has a ward. Monkey's doing gold fury. See if we can't get some wards up here. How's he doing? Can help him out. Bastet gets taken out in the right lane. Huge pick there. They're getting really low though. Shiblanki gets very low. Very low on mana. No ultimate. See if he gets picked here. There's still an Amir in the mid lane. Sobek's probably heading over to the right lane. Ares gets caught in the left lane. Anubis right behind him. He has an Aegis, he's going to use that, which means he cannot Aegis my ultimate. Let's see if we can't get him in on this. Ugh. Sobek coming in here, see if I can't zone him out. Shibalanke. He's very squishy. Even us tanks can take him out. Doing 
kind of low here. I still have an Aegis for this if I so choose, but he decides to use it on minions. Always good. We have these wards up. Going for the Fire Giant buff. Make sure we have enough wards to cover the whole angle pursuit. I'm going to go ahead and go this over here. Put that. Now we have both angles covered. Somewhat. Pushing this on. I don't think there's time to go back. We got to beast it up. Be careful. Beast it up. Oh, Ares is going for ultimate, but gets picked off on the insane damage coming out for Shibalaki and Bastet. Retreat. Don't be rude. Don't be rude, cat. Cat. Oh, jeez. You kind of, like, hurt and stuff. Haha. <laughs> Some Wukong, Shibalanki fighting over there. We got Sh we got Sobek and Bastet coming from behind me. Ultimate comes out from our Shibalanki. They're going to meet up with a Sobek. Ba Bastet chooses to chase me instead. Decides not to help the Ymir getting pretty low. The Ultimate comes out from here, which does not hit anybody. No! Oh! That was a good move from the Anubis. Sun Wukong getting out here, going after the Bastet. Bastet dropping kind of low here. Sun Wukong still lands the slow from his jump and takes out with a huge crit. Anubis lands it and goes out for the uh, Plague of Locust, but it's not enough. The beads is a little bit late. It's a huge wipe. We actually exchanged it five for one there. Amir ended up getting out there. That might be it, guys. I don't know if we can defend this off. We still have both, all three Phoenixes up right now. And the tower in the left lane. Left lane is pushed and right lane is pushed. Mid lane is right up at about the center. Ares is back up. Might be able to defend this. Next coming up is going to be Freya. Followed by me. And then Shibalanke and Sun Wukong. By that time, Bastet will be back up. No. Squiggles. Has this. Scuggles. That's what I wrote. Mumfy comes out. He needs to play this perfectly. Goes for the ultimate. See what happens here. The two ages has come out. Searing Flesh. Shabalonke ultimate comes out. Lance the stun. They're still going for the Phoenix. Phoenix goes down. The stun comes out from the mirror. The throws comes out. The so charge play. He's up on top. Decides to jump down. Gets tail whipped away. Shabalonke over some good damage here. Might have another stun coming out from Amir. The ultimate comes out from Anubis. Drops him really low. Getting very low here. Rising Jaguar goes down. Is it enough? Uses a sprint. Mummify lands on the Freya. Freya drops very quickly. Didn't even see her go because it was so slow. Damage coming out on the Shibalanke. Shibalanke getting really low here. Does the Minotaur pick him off? It's not enough. Shibalanke gets away. So that ultimate sin here going after this. They're going to go after the Minotaur kill. Let's see if we can defend this. Gets the kill. Sobek is still up there. I can pull him off. He dashes off. There's the Anubis. I want to get this Anubis. Anubis uses the sprint. Ultimate comes out for the Summon Kong right after my ultimate. Is it going to be enough? Anubis goes down. Drop the creeping curse on the Emir. Not in range from Mystical Mark. Now I am. This guy is a laggy pants. Hey, laggy pants, come back. This guy's lagging around. Bastet was most likely the one that just did. This is only a three second dash for the Heavenly Agility. He's already down. Summon Kong lands on the other side of the wall. And land the stun on him there. Gonna be enough. Wukong gets low here. Shibalanke, help me! I was saving my uh my E just for the very last second. Your left tower is under attack. 
Your left tower has been destroyed. Left tower goes down. Middle Phoenix is still down. Minotaur is about half HP. Defend the Minotaur. Defend the Minotaur. Defend the Minotaur. Minotaur is going to get pretty low here. That's you, Ares. Get that Minotaur. They're taking fire minions. Pushing this down. Minotaur taking lots of damage here. This is going to be a... Could be an epic finish, guys. Epic finish. Shablanki coming back to defend. Freya's there. Emir's still in the mid lane. They are up by a little less than 8k. Lot, a lot of lead there. Um, we're just kind of grouping up and do some good team fights. All kinds of good things happening here. Shibalanke pushing this up. I'm back up in 20 seconds. Sun Kong up in 10 seconds. Let's get some more wards for the team. Make sure that I'm not going over my hard drive size. I'm all right. Sun Wukong pushing this up. Ares Freya defending the mid lane. Right lane's pushing pretty well for us. It's up by the blue buff on the opposite side. There are no outer towers out on the map. It's just phoenixes. We need to make sure that we don't lose a fire giant. I think if they get the fire giant here, if they already have it. Group up. Group up. We uh, kind of need to be uh, together on this one. So back ultimate comes out. Goes after the Ares. Ares getting kind of low. So back ultimate. There's the ultimate coming out for the Nubis. A quick pick there. Oh, Shibalanke, bit of an angry flank there. Freya and Ares both back up. This is uh, probably game, guys. I don't know if we can defend this up. They are full force, uh, and I think they still have a few ultimates left. I think Bastet and Amir both have an ultimate. I know Sobek, Shibalanke, and Nubis all use their ulties. He's going to go for a stun, most likely. Ultimate comes out from the Ares. Pulls them in. Here's the Creeping Curse. I'm going to go after the Anubis if I quite possibly can. I think her leaf is down. It is not. Here comes the Sobek. Tough position, guys. Very tough. I don't know if we're able to pull this out or not. See if we can't get Potion of Magical Might. Try and get my uh, stature a little bit up. Behind by a significant amount. About 9k now after that. have those those two deaths. However, Shibalanki and Sun Wukong are coming up pretty soon here. The Banish does not land. Sobek pushing this up. Bastet full HP. I want to get the Bastet if I possibly can. Oof. Last second he jumped in front. Leading the way. Here comes the ultimate from Ares. Plus the beads. Bastet throws the slow out. Let's see if we can't get this stun here. I'm gonna throw him back into my teammates. Focus this Amir since he's so low. The banish was a bit unnecessary. Now we're kind of running out of time, but taking him out in good shape. Someone Kong needs to group up with here. Shibalanke is with us. They have the fire giant, I do believe. Anubis coming out here. Good mummify. Lots of damage. My god. There's a Bastet. Nice shot. So much damage. I'm not even a tank to this guy. Shibalanke. Sun Kong coming from behind. Throws out the Happy New Year. I want to respond to this as quickly as I possibly can. He's going to pull him out. Need some help here, guys. Takes out the Bastet. I won't be able to survive this. I'll take that down. But is it enough to take the win? Push, push, push. Shush, 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 shush. Uh, Syntax Love, I believe that was. No. Oh, it's not a zero. Need to bear. XXJZ. There's going to be enough, guys. Shibalanke push on this. If they can pop this. 
Sobek trying to defend. Ignore Sobek. Go for the Minotaur. Taking this Minotaur getting about half HP right now. Lots of damage coming out. Looks like we're going to take this, guys. Great victory. Huge turnaround. Thanks for turning in. As always, my name is Drybear. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I look forward to seeing you in my next game.